Wenduk became the 23rd destination in Africa, served by the award-winning Qatar Airways when its first flight landed at Hoshua Kutako International Airport from Doha on 28 September 2016. The airline operated four flights a week from the Wasia Kutaka International Airport until the outbreak of COVID-19. The state-owned airline, which serves more than 170 destinations worldwide, temporarily closed its Vendug route in 2020 due to the pandemic. However, the airline, with its fleet of more than 206 aircraft, is targeting to resume its flights in July this year. Group Chief Executive Akbar al Bakr is even keen to do it earlier than July. But I said to my people, no, I want it before. Oh. <laughs> so we will start with two frequencies, and then we will ramp up to four, and eventually we come daily. At the height of its operations during pre-COVID times, Qatar Airways served 40 million passengers, and during the pandemic, passenger numbers dropped to 12 million. al Bakr says passenger figures have now increased to 18 million people. We are very lucky to work with you. <laughs> you know, everybody, they dig and they don't find anything, but when we come, we always find uh, something. <laughs> In addition to its current fleet of 206 aircraft, which include 30 cargo planes and 20 corporate jets, Qatar Airways has 130 aircraft on order. For NBC News, I am Peter Deng, Doha, Qatar.